It's a new episode of HMS Today. I'm your host, Alina Shake. Today's show number is 165. Wow. Up first, Laura and I produced a new game show segment, 20 Questions. Today, we're going to do 20 questions, and it's going to be something school-related. Is it in a regular classroom? No. Is it a location? No. Is it something that you ride to school on? No. Is it a subject? It is not a subject. Is it anything electronically? No. Is it something a student has done in eighth grade? Not in eighth grade. Is it an in-school activity? No. Is it an after-school activity? No. Is it a type of sport? It's not a sport. Is it a building? It does take place in a building. Is it homework? Uh, It is not homework. Is it a play? It's not a play. Do you have to write on it? Yes. Um, is it a book? It's not a book. Is it a notebook? No. Do you do it in the summer? No. Is it a type of log? It's not a log. Something you normally do in your house? It is not done in your house. Is it drawing? It is not drawing. Wait, is it nature's classroom? It is! That was a great segment, Lorelai, and congrats to Nikki and Ryan. Stay tuned for another game show soon. And now it's time for Minute with an Admin. Hi, Mrs. Ben Benick. Hey there, HMS. We are approaching an important milestone in our year, April vacation. I love what this time of year signifies. Summer is coming soon. But there's a lot of work to do in the eight short weeks between our return and the last day of school. It's time to buckle down and get it all done. This year, there are changes for everyone. The first is that all students, those learning from your couch and those in the classroom, will follow the bell schedule from the fall. The important takeaway is that lunch is a little bit later for all of us. A second change, we will continue green and orange days. The green day schedule starts with homeroom and then A through G. Orange day starts with homeroom, then G, followed by B, C, D, E, F, and ends with A. Don't worry, we'll remind you. The biggest change on April 26 happens for in-person learners who now have to get out of bed early every day. Though you may not be excited to get out of your pajamas, everyone here at HMS is excited to see you. My final note is for grade eight students, check your Schoology page for information about speaking at the grade eight end of the year celebration. That's it for me this morning. Everyone remember to make it a great day. Thank you, Mrs. Benbenek. Moving on, we recently had a new segment called Show Me Your Lock Screen. And we mentioned that one of the screens was from a teacher and asked you who it was. Here's the answer. That's Finn. He's my favorite person in the whole world. Thank you, Miss Abate. We're so glad you participated. And for sending in the right answer, Sophie gets a prize. Our last segment this week is a message from high schoolers Liv and Lexi about Relay for Life. Hi guys, this is Liv. And this is Lexi, and we're here to tell you about Relay for Life. A super fun fundraiser to defeat cancer, and now is the time to join. You and a team can raise money up until May 15th that will be donated to the American Cancer Society. This year looks a little different due to COVID guidelines. We are opening up the event to everyone, whether you raised money or not. The event will have socially distant and virtual fundraisers, including a workout run by a professional on Zoom. Then a scavenger hunt through the town with relay prizes. We'll have Luminaria bags available to decorate to honor those who have passed away from cancer or were able to defeat it. Near the end of the night, we'll have a Luminaria ceremony and walk around Loop Road. To sign up, go to relayforlife.org slash hoppingtonma and join as an individual or get some friends as a team. Enter the code word CASH to pay the $10 sign-up fee later. If you raise $100, the fee can be waived. Email us with any questions about the event. We hope to see many new faces there. And those who did it in past years back again. Always cool. And now it's time for birthdays. Happy birthday, everyone. Now let's check out Mary's email. Mary sent in a submission for our Slang Weekly segment, and she used two phrases from previous segments. We caught that, Mary, and thanks for the nice comment. For you, we have a nice prize. And that's all for this week. We hope you enjoyed. Visit hms.today where you can see more HMS. See y'all next week.